Hey everyone, Basic MTB here. Real short video today. Uh, I really like using this protective tape all over my bike. I've got it on the chain stay, seat stay, on the bottom tube here, on the top tube up here. And I wanted to show you what happens when you take the tape off or need to replace it. Um, I had put some of this tape on the inside of my seat stay between the tire and the metal. Um, just because it's kind of narrow right in here, if a rock gets stuck in your tread, it could definitely scratch up the inside of your frame. So I put it on, on both sides, and that did happen on this side. If you can see, it's hard to get a good angle on it. Try and zoom in. As you can see right there, there is a scuff on the inside from a rock that got stuck and whipped around. Um, I had tape on that side. As you can see, it tore a hole in the tape. Um, I think the tape took the brunt of the impact, so if this wasn't there, I think the scratch would have been a lot worse. I already started it. It's kind of a, it's kind of difficult to start, but it comes off pretty easily once you get it started. And there's no, yeah, there's no damage to the paint from this tape. There's, there's no residue, there's no damage to the paint. Um, this is the paint's it's just really clean right here because tape was on it. But I, you know, I can't tell or feel any difference from where the tape was versus anywhere else. Um, but I think it would have been a lot worse if this tape wasn't on there. So I'm, I'm definitely gonna put a new piece on. And uh, if you do have one of these Polygon Cisco N7s or any bike that has a tight clearance, uh, I would recommend putting a little bit of this tape on the inside just to protect the inside of your frame. Um, that's it, short video. Thanks for watching, bye.